Tim Hollenthal with National Van Lines. I'm the Chief Operating Officer. National Van Lines is in the moving business, so we can move anyone uh, across the country or around the world from anywhere to anywhere. The biggest challenge facing our industry is a uh, capacity shortage. And when I talk about a capacity shortage, I'm talking about a lack of drivers. Uh, we rely on our drivers to provide the majority of our uh, left to our customers that are moving anywhere around the country. Um, there's a significant lack of drivers in the industry right now, any over the road drivers. So if you read some of the literature, you'll find that 25% um, of drivers are near retirement age. There's a 60,000, uh, uh, a shortage of 60,000 drivers right now. And uh, they think that we'll need 890,000 new over the road drivers in the next 10 years. I think the best business advice I've ever got isn't one particular thing. It's, I've heard it repeated several times from several different areas, but really it's the stories that we believe about ourselves that limit us both personally and professionally. Um, everybody's got a story, right? And that's something I like to talk about is the stories. What we do as a business is we help people tell their own stories. So we help them turn the page to the next chapter and their story. We all have stories that we tell about ourselves that frankly aren't true. It may be, I'm not good at math. I'm not a good public speaker. I'm not good at doing whatever it is that you don't think you're good at doing. But those are just stories. And we see it with salespeople all the time. They're, they, they will talk about, you know, these leads are terrible or, you know, it's, the economy's bad, although we're, we haven't heard that one for a while. But there's always these stories that we tell ourselves and it, it drives our behavior. So when it drives our behavior, uh, we start making changes and we kind of fulfill our own prophecy. Uh, there's a lot of research that's been done on, um, you know, Richard Thaler is one of the big uh, ones that have done research on behavioral economics, uh, Tversky and Kahneman on just how we make decisions and how we choose things and how our brains work, how we think our brains work versus how they really work. So we're always trying to, you know, I guess at some point you have to stop fooling yourself and try to look at the data and understand what you're really doing as opposed to the story that you've told yourself. Absolutely human capital is a tremendously important uh, part of the business. I think we are in a great position to really offer uh, folks a great opportunity to be a part of the company, to be an employee owner. And really the way I go about it is I'm extremely collaborative. Uh, so I'm asking for buy-in. I want folks, ide folks ideas. Um, I want to know what you have to say. I don't want to rush into any kind of a decision without going to the people that are the subject matter experts. So I think we give at National Van Lines, we give folks a great opportunity uh, to think on their own and not have really a top down, this is the only way things are going to work. Hey, how do you think this is going to work? How can we incorporate this into a solution that's going to help out our customer base? I think the biggest differentiator between us and our competition is um, that we truly um, operate on the basis of a small company um, values with big company resources. Uh, so we're able to, um, you know, folks want to get in touch with me, they can. Uh, my door's open and I, it literally is open most of the time. Our drivers are encouraged to come in and talk to me. I know our drivers, most of them on a first name basis. Um, I want to hear from them. We want to have that open door policy throughout the company. And I think that really uh, helps make us a lot closer to our, to our customer so that we can hear them, so that we can reach them when they need help.